Today should be a very interesting day. I'm going back to Harvard and I'll be meeting up with the other students who were part of this documentary. I haven't seen many of them for 15 years or so. So it'll be fascinating to see how they have grown as people and matured as physicians. I'm Tom Tarter. I'm a board certified emergency physician. <laughs> yeah, it is. You still working here? What? You know, I'm not here. I'm in California. You've got a little bit of gray. Yeah, I got a little gray. Bit. Yeah, okay. you bet. Yeah, I've got them too. Hi, I'm Dr. Luanda Grisette, and I'm a cardiologist. To me, I kind of like seeing, you know, who they've become. And we were all just figuring out what we were going to be then. Dr. David Friedman, ophthalmologist and public health researcher. I'm Dr. Jane Leapschutz. I'm an internal medicine, primary care, and preventive medicine physician. Just the sheer sense of history with these enormous buildings, I think, is really what, uh, what I remember. I mean, it's, it's almost overwhelming in a way. Dr. Elliot Benacolero, anesthesiologist. Hi, <laughs> how are you? I haven't seen you guys in so long. I haven't seen you, by God, how long have you been in? So good. I'm Cheryl Dorsey. I was trained as a pediatrician at Harvard Medical School. I'm Jay Bonner, and I'm a psychiatrist. We graduated 17 years ago. Can you imagine? It's like we're old fogies, <laughs> but I don't feel it. I feel like it was a few months ago. <laughs> well, when I first got in, I kept wondering if it was a mistake, really. Like somebody was gonna pull me aside and go, didn't you get that next letter that said, um, we're sorry, but the first one was a mistake? And it, it was kind of strange because I, even though when I interviewed here and I toured the place, I really felt at home, I still I've never really pictured myself in the environment. And I still, when I walk across the quad sometimes, I just kind of, it hits me sometimes, God, I'm at Harvard. The enteric hormone system and the enterochromaffin system, there are a variety of different names for this whole collection of different cells. Going through this thing called the thorax. I knew I couldn't be a businessman. I could never do that because I wouldn't care about any sort of product. I care about people. A renal arteriogram. And you're going to tell me something. I'm very interested in working with urban poor. A lot of people don't have advocates for their health. Um, even though we supposedly have a glut of physicians, there's still a lot of areas which are underserved. And um, there's a great need for good people to go in and work in those areas. <laughs> 